dare they say they're doing this for the flesh. I still have a house. Wow, but it's like putting people right in the break car. I guess they don't have a choice, but rather them than me. What if other reactors are you still so right now? Oh, man. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. Hey, Cloud. I am. Um, if you're there. about to unburden yourself, out. don't. Yeesh. You don't make it easy. No thieves get my money. Hey! Oh, never mind. Sorry to disturb you. Hey, got a sec? You're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? Why don't you learn I'm a to take a hit, buddy? Well, my hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or Why don't you not. learn to take a hit, buddy? Do you think who ties to blame? A little help, Cloud? Please? I can't sure stop thinking about it. The too. bomb I made shouldn't nah, have produced an explosion that happen. big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly. But I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <sighs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? <laughs> uh, uh, shh. Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? <laughs> We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Them spiking words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> Time for a little nap. Hey, this train is slower than the last. You hear that suit? Shinra Creed, my ass. We're the good guys, damn it. get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. 
They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. What I tell you, have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, ah. right. Ah. Hmm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. Fried Marsh. Hand forward. Hear me out. Oh, uh -huh. one drink uh -huh. And why did we have to come to the slum? Yeah. I've never felt the ground shake like that. What kind of oh. So I'm glad he's only had it so good because uh -huh. I've never seen anything like it before. It was completely uh -huh. insane. Security was out. It was like a giant candle All lighting up the whole piled sky. Up like mountains. Mm -hmm. You couldn't go nowhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Now the hell it is. K 
goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> 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 What the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. Shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. Are you busy? Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. You don't want to mess with the monsters in here. Move along now. Um, excuse me, uh, due to an emergency, entry into this area is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? No, sir! remember the last time I saw a real one. Huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? Guy can change. Has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of all that. Uh. <gasps> hey! What uh, the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right. But just this once. <sighs> 
Uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, afraid. About that. We should talk outside. Um, Daddy? Did the people who died... Let that be a lesson to you. Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. <coughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Not good at all. I don't know what it is. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are, good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with 7th Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? <coughs> oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. What are you doing? You've never even met this person. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd <coughs> love to set it up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. <coughs> the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. Bad. Guess it's time for introductions. Hey, 
You okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you <coughs> It can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she doing? <coughs> the granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Come on, quit lollygagging and go to Seventh Heaven already. saying they're gonna step up their game. How? Ain't they short-handed? Absolutely. Plus. Was thinking I might chat up on all extra my hard to recruit more people. Searching for candidates. Is that who Wedge mentioned? <coughs> what does he say again? If you don't want to get hurt, keep your distance. So it's massive. Searching for candidates. Don't try it. Anything funny or you'll get it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. You stay. Everybody does. We keep the God knew something about the monsters on the <coughs> 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 
do something about the monsters on the ship. Hold on. Don't tell me you're making that. Stronger! Faster! Cooler! So it looks like they're having a bad day. Try getting more sleep. That's the best girl. We gotta do something about the monsters on Trap Boulevard. Even our facilities are starting to look over. I still can't believe there's this one dude in the watch who's like a genius cat. <laughs> Just me or the uh -uh. Right. There's this one dude in the walk. <coughs> it might be a good idea to stop one of the three. Three. Take a picture, why don't you? Go find somewhere else to hang out. Call us if you see trouble. dinner at 7th Heaven tonight. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. <sighs> Most every home in the area has one. Folks <sighs> love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this case. <clears throat> And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? <sighs> Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. <clears throat> Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. 
Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. So Barrett's out making his rounds, too. Don't take your eyes as long as I get it all together. Take your time now. You can walk straight from the roof. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to. Wait, who is he? Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here. Maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. para que entra el grupo si no va a hablar como de pinga esto market for anything else drop on by especially if teeth is with you we'll see you around okay and let us know when your filter next needs changing take a look around if you want <coughs> all the items you can want straight from the plate He's a regular. Stock up here, and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, Bing she's a good friend of on. Avalanche, so be nice. Please. And decided to go to the station and see. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for you. Tifa, my dear, dear girl. <laughs> oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. <coughs> Are you getting <coughs> enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. <coughs> now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. You'd have more color in your cheeks if you went to bed earlier. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. <sighs> Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You've been here a while now? Five years, give or take. <coughs> uh, 
but never mind that. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapons drawer. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter, huh? Hey, that last filter didn't do shit. We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? <coughs> My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty no please. <laughs> Thank uh, you very much. Uh, well, Seeing as we're you? done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Uh, well. well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? Before we open up tonight, it'll be a while yet, so... Uh -huh. What do you want to do? Uh, I'll just wait and see how it goes. What do you want to do? Don't really know. Uh -huh. In that case, I've got a suggestion. If you're serious, in a final, if you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? <sighs> Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get eh? you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Claro que no, hmm. Why not help out the neighborhood watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. No, Raulito. Yeah, okay. Didn't no, see anybody at the office, so let's head up no top. Eh? No better way to keep you no, and your family cuando, safe. No, cuando cuando yo no sabía eso, yo pensaba así como tú piensas también. No, no, no. Cuando tú lo pones en trío, nada más hay jugadores de equipo de tres. Cuando tú lo pones en cuatro, nada más hay jugadores de cuatro. Y cuando lo pones solo, soy de a uno, nada más. I wonder. Hey, no better way to keep you and your family safe mm -hmm. than with a weapon of your own. <coughs> Le falta el dedo, el dedo lo pusieron, no el dedo no lo puesto. Friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs. No, Raulito, pero que entonces te van a aparecer ese equipo de cuatro. We got to do something about the monsters on scrap. Mm -hmm. Yo pensaba así también en Fortnite, porque en Fortnite yo en Fortnite de de uno, de dos y de cuatro. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Uh -huh. Oh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this sí, neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our no top is no taking demasiado. care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, mm -hmm. the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example, aha, what about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine, just the way it is. What, you some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. A mí el que me gustaba antes en el PlayStation 1, creo yo, Resident Evil, que es susto me daba yo ahí. Sí, yo sé, yo sé. Sí. sí, con Don Ryan, sí. Sí, pero ahí había una residente, yo me acuerdo que uno iba por una casa, muchachos, sí. Y te iba caminando, muchachos, y de, de repente así te salta un perro por la ventana, así, y rompe la ventana, ay, qué susto.
No, eso lo van a decir el, el uno o el mal te lo dicen. <coughs> Set. Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who listen about the new Mercantown. No, no, for <coughs> There isn't anyone que que se know. Se I'll march through the streets singing your praises, Como even seca. on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Square mm. Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? Yep, we don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Let's see. Pero que con ese virus no se sabe, porque ese virus. Mm -mm. Ese virus, ese virus no vino de la nada, ese virus lo hicieron. Scrap Boulevard is out west. Past the barricade, supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare. Yo te voy a mandar un video para que te lo veas. ¿Cómo es posible que en China solamente haya una ciudad inundada de, 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 de contagio? Yo agarraron, yo agarraron la ciudad más perra que ellos tienen, donde comen perros y animales y todo. ¿Por qué no se enfermó no ahí nadie en Shanghái? Uh -huh. Entonces, no me digas por qué nada más se lo ha a los chetados. ¿Eh? Yeah. En Estados Unidos. y el y el el vejerte de tal También te voy a mandar, te voy a mandar un video para que veas eh, por qué hicieron el video chino wow. y también so para que tu mamá haga eso. Like Mismo que ella no tenga nada, one. pero si ella se está sintiendo algo en la garganta, esto viene, esto se mete por la garganta. Esto tiene un tiempo. No, 
bicarbonato, vitamina C y... Uh -huh. Eso, güey. La... El amigo mío de la fuente, la cuña de él. Porque eso se mete por ahí, por el ganso. Entonces, una, la, la cuña de un amigo mío. Que no dije que yo lo oí, que, que, que eso, eso es de cuento oficial. La mujer, la, la cuña de él, el marido de ella, eh, dio positivo. Y está, y ya estaba en el hospital. Y ella dice que no puede ser que ella no te contagia porque ella duerme con él. Entonces ella tenía como fiebre y la dejaron en cuarentena en la casa. Ella no podía salir de la casa. Entonces ella agarró, ella tenía que esperar cinco días para que le hicieran la prueba. Ella agarró, no tenía nada en la casa, como no podía salir, agarró bicarbonato, vitamina C. Y empezó a hacer acá. Y a los cinco right. días fueron a hacer el, el, la prueba y dio negativo. Uh -huh. Y eso es. Y eso es. Y lo mismo pasó quiet con, in the con, también con la, a win. con la hermana de un amigo de Nacho que estaba aquí, que juega con nosotros. Me, Yo you. le mandé el video right. y la, la hermana Lynch. del dio positivo. El marido también dio positivo, estaba en el hospital y la hermana de él la dejaron en la casa en cuarentena y dio positivo. O sea que si son dos parejas, eso se pega, eso se... El otro seguro lo tiene 100%. No, te lo voy a mandar ahora, todavía no lo he mandado. ¿Estás okay? Sí, por lo vas a ver, vamos a ver. Fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village. It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no, you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Sorry, Go on. maybe next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. <sighs> hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. 
I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on Scrap Boulevard? You know, there's a hole in the break room roof. You should probably get that fixed. Hold up. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Mm -hmm. Sorry about before. Mm -hmm. I get antsy when business is slow. <sighs> man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. de este video que ya lo vi aquí lo que tú lo que pasó en Santo Domingo o sea lo que dijo Balaguer hace hace siglo sí Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know, could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Searching for candidates. Ah, uh, hey there, Chiva. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, uh, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself at these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon, excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity, perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. An optimal candidate! My name is Chadley. 
I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. <coughs> I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia, as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. Uh -oh. Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. Monster Slayer now. The watch is saying they're Huh? What's gonna happen? <laughs> I don't mean. Can't help but take a look. You know, all the items you can want are straight from the place. Hey there, Tifa. Welcome back. And you, the new Mercantown looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were rat buddies have been tearing up town, looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't lie. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were rat in pain will call its friends for help. <clears throat> And the whole rat pack will come running yeah, just like that. Figure the pack must be nesting somewhere just outside of town. Good hunting. Seems a whole bunch of giant rats have been <coughs> coming in the vacant lot lately. Non-stop squeaking is driving me insane. Hello, hello! Oh, what do we have here? 
I'm guessing you're that merc I've heard so much about. You're not here to...